Google Gemini has completely changed the game when it comes to creating graphics. In this training, I'm gonna show you seven different ways that you can use Google Gemini to create some amazing graphics. So you ready? Let's go. So I'm gonna head on over to Google Gemini, gemini.google.com, and we're going to enter a series of prompts into Gemini that will create amazing illustrations. So the first thing that we'll do is what's called a sketch note infographic. It's like a whiteboard style infographic. We're at gemini.google.com and I'm going to type in this prompt for you. Now to get all the prompts, check the description for this video and you'll get all of the prompts. But here we go. So it's a called a sketch note infographic and you can see that I'm asking it to have the style be waterboard marker friendly sketch like and then I'm asking it to include a robot mascot, hand-drawn icons. I love the hand-drawn style of this. Wait till you see it. Arrows connecting concepts, a mix of illustration and text. And then the colors I chose here are blue line art, black line art with blue and yellow accents. Choose whatever you want. And I chose a vertical output uh, or format for social media. So look at this result right here. Isn't this amazing? double check to make sure that there's no typos. But when you look at this right here, it's a amazing infographic and I absolutely love it. So this is the first one. Now let's move on to number two. I hope that you love that. Check it out, grab the prompt and try it yourself. Number two is that we're gonna create an infographic. And this infographic will be not the hand-drawn style, but more, um, professional looking, not hand-drawn. So you can see here that I put the style as a modern corporate with clean data visualization. Now, one thing that I want you to keep in mind with both of these designs that we've made so far is that I have not told Gemini everything to put on the design. I have just said, this is what I want it to come uh, to be about. And so what it's done is it's gone out and it's got the information to put on the slides and then designed it at the same time. And this is why I completely love using this. Whereas with Canva, when I make infographics, you're finding a great template and replacing the content yourself. But Gemini is creating all the content. Here we go. Uh, and let's look at this. I'm going to zoom in for just a minute and you can see how nice this graphic actually looks. So it's gone out and it's found the information and put it on the infographic. So that's two out of the seven. Should we keep going? <laughs> Let's keep going. So the next example for Google Gemini is a carousel post for um, Instagram. So I'm going to paste this prompt right in here. And remember, you'll get all of the prompts. So in this prompt here, it says, generate a sequence of 10 separate images for an Instagram carousel, about five AI productivity apps every professional needs. And then I go on to talk about the aspect ratio. I want this one to be square. So please indicate the aspect ratio that you want. And then when we put the word CTA, that's the call to action. So I asked the call to action to be to have people join my business summit. So it says join the AI business summit for more AI strategy with Alicia Little, AIbusinesssummit.com. And I have a typo there on summit. So I'm going to have to fix that. And so this will be a good example of showing you how it can fix as well. So right now I'm already going to say is the correct um, URL, the one I gave you had a typo, please correct. So after all the images are created, look at them, see if there's any corrections that needs to be made and tell Gemini to make the corrections. So it's almost done. The one thing that I really love about this example here is that it's gonna create 10 separate images for the carousel post, and they will be in order as you would post them on, in this case, Instagram as a carousel image. So you need to tell Gemini when you're creating your carousel image, what the aspect ratio is, how you want it to look. So this says it should have a bold, modern, high contrast style with a solid 
black background and then what the color scheme should be. So think of what your color scheme should be. In this case, I said black, white, and electric blue, accent colors for titles, icons, and key elements. And then the typography must be large, clean, and optimized for mobile. So whatever you want it to be, change this all around. And then the call to action is to join the business summit. So let's check it out. Okay, look at this. Here's image number one, and it is the cover image, and I absolutely love it. Image two is hack number one. There you go, hack number two, hack three, four, five. Um, image seven is a quick recap, eight, nine, and I would tell it to change that picture to mine, and then level up your AI game, join the business summit. So two changes. We're gonna change the business summit. And then I'm also going to upload a photo of myself. And then um, I would give it the photo of myself so that it can um, use the photo of myself for the image instead of the placeholder. So we'll always put a placeholder there and you've gotta just replace it with a photo of yourself. So then I'm going to say, um, please correct and replace the photo of the lady with one of me image attached. All right, perfect. So make sure that you double check everything and you're good to go. All right, should we keep going? Exciting so far. So far we have done uh, this really great sketch hand-drawn infographic. We've done another infographic as well, a corporate look. And then we have created Instagram carousel posts. And now we're asking it to make some changes to that. So let's keep going. The next one is a PowerPoint slide. Did you know that you can create your slides in Gemini? Crazy, right? So let's go to Gemini. We're going to paste this in here in Gemini. But I want you to click on tools and then click on Canvas. You have to click on Canvas. <clears throat> and when you do that, <clears throat> now you're gonna see, we're gonna press Submit. And it's gonna go. So Canvas is the, the key here when creating PowerPoint slides. Let's let this keep going, because it's gonna take a few minutes to create our slides. But one of the things that I want you to notice in this prompt is that, and I'll show you the prompt here, is that it says that it's a 12 slide presentation for AI implementation strategy for consultants. I run an AI consultant certification program, but all I said was the audience, what to include, the style and the colors. I did not give it the content for the slides. It will come up with the content and design the slides all in one. Okay, let's keep going. What number are we on? We're on number five. One of my favorites, it's going to be a comic strip to promote my AI business summit. So let's go ahead and open up Gemini. And then we're going to paste in this um, prompt right here. I'm also going to upload a picture of myself. And then we're going to press go. All right, so if we look at this prompt, it says create a three panel comic strip and then kind of the title of the comic strip, Entrepreneur Discovers AI and Transform Businesses. What the style is, the main character, professional woman, maintain exact same appearance across all panels. Um, purple blazer, confident expression, like whatever you want you would put there. But now we've got its version of me that I uploaded here. Too much work, let me help, AI tools and automation, and then game changer, and then learn more, AI business summit. See how it has my call to action right there for the business summit? So this is great. All right, so we have now done our three panel comic strip. There's my example of one. And now let's do a storyboard. We have two more examples to go. So now let's try the storyboard. So we're gonna open up Gemini. Uh, we need to go back and check on the PowerPoints. We'll do that in a minute. And then I'm also going to upload a photo of myself. So for the storyboards and the comic strips, you can upload a photo of yourself and put yourself in the comic strips and storyboards, which is really quick. 
cool. So now we have the storyboard, create a six frame storyboard for AI consultant promotional video. So it's a storyboard and there we go. Um, let's go back to the slides and see if it is done. Is it complete? Wow, 13 slides already done. Let's check them out. So now we can just um, go across, pushing the across arrows and check out our PowerPoint presentation. It's looking good, it's looking good. Here's slide seven, slide eight, slide nine, 10, 11, 12, and 13. And then now it's our it's our turn to change anything what, that we want on the slides. So you can export to Google Slides. You can also download the presentation and you can also share it. So you think about what you want to do with this presentation and good, we did that. All right, let's go back and check out our storyboard and our storyboard is done. So it said frame one, establish a shot, wide angle. Can you see the storyboard? Very nice. I love these storyboards. All right. Medium shot, low angle. And then you see this right here. So really good storyboard. Okay. So we have one, <laughs> one left, one example left, and that is creating a poster. So let's go ahead and create a poster next. So we'll ask it to create a poster for the AI business summit. I'll upload my photo with this one as well. And if we have any other details, um, I'm going to say for Alicia Littles, Alicia Littles AI Business Summit. And then, um, then, uh, you know, event title, date, speaker slots. I do these all the time. So I might just, um, put register today. Hopefully you've already registered for it. Register today. And then... All I'm going to do there, deep bold, and then we're going to press go, and it's going to generate a poster for us for the conference. So we've done a lot. Let's recap. And yes, you are going to get all of the prompts, but we created this cool whiteboard style marker friendly sketch. I loved it. And then we created infographics, professional type infographics with Gemini. And then we created a carousel post. Wait, did I, did we see the end result? of the carousel post. Oh, we redid it and you can see, look at this. That last slide looks really good. What? Level up your AI game. Join the AI Business Summit for more AI strategy with Alicia Little. Learn AI strategy from Alicia Little. Join the AI Business Summit. So I could make some corrections there. I know that I need to put two Ms in Summit so I would tell it real quick and I'd make that. But, you know, not bad for Carousel posts, some of you aren't doing carousel posts just because it takes a long time to create it, especially in different tools. But now Gemini can create all of the slides for you, which I absolutely love. So we did carousel posts, we did PowerPoint, we did a comic strip, which was very cool, a storyboard, which I loved as well. And then we created a poster. So I hope that you use Gemini to create the digital assets that you need. I have a business summit coming up and I'm creating all my digital assets with Gemini and some with ChatGPT. So uh, to check out more and to learn more about how to do this, join me for my AI business summit. It's just AIBusinessSummit.com. It is completely free to join the summit. So I go all in with live demonstrations, just like we did here in this training, showing you how to leverage artificial intelligence for the win. See you on the AI business summit.